This is Eagle Al, and let's get straight into it, man. Um, actually, before I get straight into the video, I want to thank y'all. Almost got this channel monetized. I definitely want to thank y'all for that. We got the watch hours. You know, just need the subscribers, and thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's really hard to get monetized. Imagine trying to get two channels monetized. It's, it's difficult, but you guys always hold me down and support me. But let's get into Jalen Carter, man, and the Eagles. Eagles are looking to trade up for Jalen Carter. Um, it's being reported that the Seahawks will pass on him. So we're talking about six, seven. Maybe we can. We know we got two second round picks next year. Maybe we trade one of them and trade a second round this year. I, I don't know. But whatever it takes, and if you see Jalen Carter falling, Whatever it takes to get in front of the Bears and the Falcons. If we could get to that seven, I think the Raiders are right there. I think if it's true and the Seahawks pass on them, you got to do it. You got to trade up for him. He, he's, a, he's a really great player. He has the potential of being a generational talent. Definitely had the potential of being that guy. Do he have character issues? Absolutely. Um, But if you put him besides... Beside um, Jordan Davis, Howie Roseman, you know, Jalen Hurts of the world, Brandon Grahams, uh, Fletcher Cox, he will be just fine. He will he will get that whatever he's doing together, man. I, I promise you. But it's going to be hard. You see a guy dropping like that and get past the Seahawks and don't trade up for him. It's going to be hard just to let him fall, you know. And just let them try to fall to you because Atlanta and the Bears. Atlanta and the Bears could definitely use him for sure. But, man, like I said, just just that talent. That talent, man. Yeah. Also, he do have a motor issue, but that's okay when you got a rotational uh, defensive line. His motor can be questioned a bit sometimes, but with the guys I named, add Milton Williams in there. He will be just fine as a Philadelphia Eagle. And I think, like I said, his talent just alone is great enough to trade up for. So the draft is on the way. You know, a lot of news coming out. We here in Atlanta might take B. John. We hearing teams are scared for the Eagles to take B. John. Now we hearing that the Eagles might trade up for Jalen Carter. Now we hear the Seahawks don't want Jalen Carter. This is draft week. Two days away. I can't wait for it. And then to really evaluate the draft and the players we got. That 10th and 30th, man. Those guys got to be immediate starters to me. I think you should. If you're going to trade up for a defensive guy, Jalen Carter is worth it. But if you go defense and you, or you're planning on going defense early, you probably could trade back that 10th overall and add extra picks. But offensive guy... Today, if you go B. John, I think you stay right there. If you go JSN, you stay right there. You, but Jalen Carter or like Will Anderson, one of those dudes dropping, you got to trade up. You got to trade up. So um, I, I like the idea. I won't be surprised if how we try to do that because he did it with Jordan Davis. He knew the Ravens were right behind us. He did it with Jordan Davis. I will not be surprised if he do it with Jalen Carter. He loved the trenches. So this is one of the reports I believe is possibly definitely true. B. John, you really question a bit, but when it comes to that defensive line, offensive line, and there's reports that how we want one of those guys, I give about 95% that is true. But the skill guys, you got to give it like a 50-50 shot. The JSN... Rumor, 50-50. The B. John rumor, 50-50. But this rumor right here about Jalen Carter, I think it's possibly spot on. Hey, if we got the assets to do it, and somebody is crazy enough to trade up with us and let the Eagles get Jalen Carter, hey, hey, uh, teams are scared of, about B. John. I would be more afraid of Jalen Carter or us getting JSN. I'm just keeping it real. Definitely keeping it real, man. But what do you think and how do you feel about Jalen Carter possibly being the Eagle and us trying to trade up for him? 
I love the rumor for sure. I think that it will be a great move. But even if you decide to stay at 10 and get some talent at 10, hey, it's going to be somebody there. It's going to be a B. John there, Jason there. Trade back, could get a Nolan Smith. Trade back, get a Brian Branch. It's a lot of talent, man. That's why that 10th overall is so perfect. Now, the 30th, it get a bit shaky a bit as um, far as talent-wise. But, hey, we're in the top 10. Like, we were a bad team. We were just in the Super Bowl. So, we, we got to add an explosive guy. I don't want a development piece. I know you guys saying the offensive line, this and that, with that 10th overall. I need immediate impact. I need immediate impact. That's why I wouldn't be mad if we get B. John. And I wouldn't be mad if we get JSN. I need immediate impact. But this is Eagle Al. I'm out.